Hello, this is Buona from Buona.tv. Today, I'm going to answer, hey, what time is it? You guys love this clock, don't you? Tell me, what time is it right now? What time is it? Anyway, I had a question from uh, Buona.tv Q&A on Twitter. To do this, you just have to sign up for Twitter.com, ask a question, and put a hashtag at the end, which is a pound sign, and Buona TV QA, all one word. Once you do that, then uh, it'll show up in my queue and I review them every night. And I'm trying to answer the ones that are submitted but not uh, recorded because I can't record everything because some questions are more in depth than, than others and some are easy to answer in one word or less. So this one is uh, going to come by way of Twitter and it's from Tech Helper One. And, uh, he says, how do you have the dock to be a different color on your Mac? Are you using themes or hacking? So on to Mr. Tech Helper's question. Yes, Tech Helper, I am using a combination of themes and hacking. Because he asked, are you using themes or hacking? Um, there are dock themes out there. And uh, I'll tell you about the sites in a second. but. The method that I'm using was recommended to a guy, to me by a guy who wrote an app. You may have heard of it. Um, let's get the name, make sure I get it right. It's, it's a LoJack type application for Mac, and it's called I Alert You. And uh, it uses, the, uh, it uses the, the motion detection stuff that's in Macs so that when you leave your Mac, you like, you know how you set a car alarm? You can use your remote to set their, their alarm if somebody picks up your laptop. It, goes off in the long. Pretty cool, huh? But it uses a uh, trigger by keyboard and mouse and all that stuff. But I got it from the same site and it's called slappingturtle.com and the guy named, he goes by the handle Rotozip. You may have heard of him. He's a very great developer. But he wrote an app called Swap My Doc. Swap My Doc. And all it is is a window that comes up and what you do is that you drag and drop a doc theme to the app and it will change your doc. Now where do you get doc names from? There's plenty of different places available. Uh, first one is doculicious.com, D-O-C-K-U-L-I-C-O-U-S.com, spelled just like it's pronounced, doculicious. Then there's leoparddocs.net, and then there's leoparddocs.com. So Swap My Doc is absolutely free. You just go get the program and then you look at these themes and uh, you can change your doc. But I must warn you that this is sort of hacking. So if you're not comfortable with changing your Mac environment in that fashion, then don't do it because you know there is a slight possibility that it can mess up things. Just like if you hack the Windows shell or if you go too far with the Windows or the Linux um, desktop manager, you could break something. Same as the case here. So be careful with it. But Tech Helper One, that's how I customize my doc. Uh, what happened was I posted a screenshot of my desktop on Twitter and he saw it and he saw a picture of my dock and uh, he was like that's, that's that's not the standard dock and um, that's how we did it so take couple one swap my dock plus these sites and you'll have your own custom dock so thanks for the question and take care